Hey guys, welcome back to the House of Hughes. If you're new here, my name is Rachel. For those of you that are returning, you know what this look and this backdrop means. Being nice and comfy and cozy, I was definitely not planning on filming a video today, but I had a really impactful comment left on my channel this morning. You guys can tell I'm already emotional. I know, nothing that you wouldn't expect at this point. But I don't even know like how to make this video, but sometimes things just hit me and I feel like I'm supposed to make a video about it. I feel like it's the right thing to do. And the very first thing I wanna say is if I say anything that comes across incorrect or wrong in any way, I am so sorry. I'm truly trying to speak from my heart and I open all comments in the comment section and if there is any need for me to apologize by the end of this video, I absolutely will. Today's video is not about me and it is 100% about you. So I want to read you guys the comment that was made. I uh, opened up my comment section in one of my last videos at the end of a video and asked you guys to let me know if there was anything that I could pray for, for you. And a really sweet woman left this comment on that video this morning. I'm not gonna say her name just to respect her privacy, but she did leave this comment publicly and she will know who she is but she said, I could use a prayer. I lost my five week old daughter to SIDS last year. Her birthday just passed and I'm currently expecting. My rainbow baby in July. I really need this baby to raise this baby and watch her grow. My heart can't take another loss. <sighs> I would typically apologize for being so emotional, but this comment <laughs> warrants my tears. <sighs> I talk a lot on this channel about disability and some of the heartache that it's brought me. <sighs> But I realized this morning that I needed to tell all of you who have ever lost a child how grateful I am for the situation that I'm in and that I am aware that my life has been some of your best case scenarios that you were only able to dream of. I have put out some videos really opening up to you guys about how difficult it has been as Beckham has progressed developmentally and some of the loss that I've felt. Although so incredibly proud of him, obviously disability comes with the loss of the life you hoped that your child would have. And... <sighs> When I read that comment this morning, my heart was filled with so much gratitude that my baby came home from the NICU and I wanted to make this video to honor all of the mothers who have not been as fortunate as I am. And I just want you to know that I am so sorry if any of you have lost a child. It is a feeling you cannot comprehend unless you've experienced it. And although I've tasted the fear of not bringing a child home, I have not had to mourn that loss. And I am so sorry for the loss and the hole in your heart that that must leave for a lifetime. My heart, is moved more when I hear about 
infant loss or child loss than anything else. I'm sorry, I know that you guys can hear Beckham giggling, giggling upstairs. I am so grateful that Beckham is here. I am so grateful that I get to raise him during Earth Life and I know that that has just been my biggest blessing and I wish that I could extend that blessing to everyone. I have a few close family friends and friendships that I've developed with those who have lost children and the topic of God, of course, has come up and I always wish I knew what to say to comfort them because God doesn't love me any more than he loves you. All I know how to say is that all I really know is that you are God's elite and that doesn't mean that you deserve it. It doesn't make it any less unfair, but I just know that you will be able to see your child again. And it's so unfair for me to even, even say that. It's not fair that my child's here and yours isn't. And I'm, I'm just so sorry. And I just wanted to put out this video because I think that sometimes when you guys leave comments, you know, you know that I read them, but you you don't know how much they mean to me. And I just thought, you know, if I'm going to be sitting here crying this afternoon because of that sweet comment that was made, and I'm so grateful for those of you that ask me to pray for you. It's an honor to be able to pray for everyone who watches my videos. I know that you're all dealing with things that are much more severe than what I'm dealing with. And just because someone is dealing with something more severe than you doesn't make what you are experiencing any less severe. But it certainly puts things into perspective. And I've been, you know, having a difficult time with Beckham's feeding lately. And, you know, that comment, <laughs> just woke me up and made me realize how blessed I am to have a baby to worry about, <laughs> to worry about if they'll walk or talk. And I'm so grateful that I get to raise Beckham. Just so grateful. And of course, I'm so grateful I get to raise Blakely. But of course, you guys understand that just the message I wanted to send is that I love you and I see you and your loss is truly the greatest loss you can experience on earth and I full heartedly believe that and I just I would absolutely be lying if I said that I'm not so grateful <laughs> that I'm I'm not a mother who's experienced loss in that sense and although I was close it, you can't compare it. You can't compare it. I didn't lose him. And I'm so sorry for those of you that have lost your children. And I just want you to know that I love you. And I mourn with you. I truly do. It's not fair. No matter how much I full heartedly believe that you will be reunited with that child, it doesn't take the pain away. This video was literally just made for you. And I don't know if it will bring comfort and if it makes anyone angry. I'm so sorry. I will accept any criticism in the comments for anything that I said that maybe came across as if I didn't understand because I don't understand. But I just thought like, I can't just reply to that comment. Like I just really felt like I needed to make a whole video about it. And I don't know who this video is gonna reach I don't, but I just like want you to know that I love you and I'm so honored, so honored that mothers who have lost their children are a part of this community. I just, I feel so blessed and I want you to know that 
I love you and I'm so grateful that you would pray for my child, that you would be happy for me, that you are godly enough to mourn your own loss and celebrate what I have. And I'm just so grateful for you and you make me want to be a better woman and a better mother. And to the sweet girl that um, left this comment, I just want you to know that I love you and I felt like you deserved this video along with all the other mothers that have also lost their children. I apologize that I cried this entire video, but you know, some things are just worth filming and this was worth it. So I love you. I just wanted to take a moment to honor everyone who is absolutely, positively, without a doubt, brave like Beckham. I love you guys.